All right, Hollywood Squares. I'm pretty sure this game I have to read a lot, right? Yeah, watching TV. I don't ever I have never seen this show. Huh. Okay. How many contestants? Let's just do. Oh, let's just do two. I can answer all the questions, right? Do I just pass out a second control? Let's just do one. Would you like a new character? Player one? No. Enter name. Oh, that's my boy. Retro Arcade Music Man. I saw him uh, live on the other day, but I was just able to, you know, select a celebrity. Christine Sue. Ooh, look at you, Sue. So all the women look like that. May. Who's this guy? Daz? According to body politics, your arms are crossed, your coat is buttoned, and you are starting to rub your nose. What inner feelings are you expressing? To decide to be an Eskimo. What? No. <laughs> this is so stupid. Also, his his turn out. I'm not gonna read it. Well, maybe I need to. Most child bring express agree. The ideal spacing between children is what? Oh, so you just have to agree or to disagree. You know, it's also interesting, right? I actually wrote down something I want to talk about today. Is like. Who watches TV without a plan anymore? You know? Like live TV. Remember back in the day when you turn on the channels, right? Like the channel surfing, so that way you can see like what's on TV. Who does that anymore? Or to see blocks? What? Like now when I watch TV, I know exactly what I'm going to, to watch, right? Like doesn't most people like, hey, I'm gonna pick up something on Hulu is because something like a TV show I just miss, missed it a few days ago and things like that. So according to hints from Heloise, is it ever a good idea to pour cola on the battery of your Rolls Royce? Um, only if it's a vintage year for cola nuts. No, disagree. <laughs> oh, I thought this game was gonna be difficult. It's actually pretty easy. I'm having a good week so far playing Hit the Ice. According to Self Magazine, what is the most stressful month of the year? Oh, probably December. Whichever one lasts longer than your page. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, so do you watch TV? Does anybody watch TV? I'm gonna pick all the fine ladies now. Like just channel surfing? What was the first made? What was first made in Egypt over three thousand years ago by mixing fruits with nuts and honey? Oh, I don't know. Granola pyramid? Uh, I'm gonna disagree. Okay, so am I wrong? Do I have any points? Oh no! What happened last time is I I, I got YouTube TV right, and I was flipping through the channels and I saw um the Con Air was on. But then I was like, so I start watching that because I was like, oh, they know I would love that Nicolas Cage movie. And they had commercials. And before you know it, I um, I actually stopped YouTube TV to go to the co like the digital copy that I purchased and watch it from there. Because you know they cut out all the uh, they cut out all the bad words, and I didn't want that. Whose fans are known as the Baker Street Irregulars? Ooh, I do not know this one. Tammy Faye Baker. Disagree. Wrong. Correct answer is Sherlock Holmes. Huh. So do we not have any points? I thought I got one correct. Or do they just text stuff? Uh, let's go, Beth. What country has the highest percentage of females in top government positions? The Virgin Islands. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to agree. Dang it. It's Norway, man. But at that time, right? This game is from the 80s. I don't know how much is still, this is still relevant. Deception, the cons, Transformers, Winkles, and Madballs are all currently what? Oh man. What? Can you please agree? Dang it. Toys for kids? What are these answers from? All right, May. Take me home, Madam Marie. Curry was the first woman ever to win it what? The Miss Radium 
Imagine. No, she won a Nobel Prize, right? Yeah, see, look. So I did disagree. Didn't I get it right? What the hell is this game, man? What's the next line of the song? When somebody loves you, it's no good unless they love you twice a day? He agrees. Correct all the way. What? Rob has one. I don't see any point. Oh, game just start. Okay, let's try it again. Find a secret square. All right. Like a celebrity wham. Let's do Mikey. Is it ever a good idea to put vodka on your eyeglasses? Only if you can't find your mouth. I'm just going to agree. What? Oh, you have to play the whole game. You win the round and then you got that game. Okay. Which is the following is not a real animal. An arc dog? And what? That's a very odd question. Okay, I you know it's really funny. I probably don't get it now, right? And then later, then I, after I have a few hours to think about it after I shoot this, I'm like, oh, this is how you play this game. Well, unless someone tells me. According to the Dictionary of Scriptures and Myth, when you hear the voice of God, you are really hearing what? Memorex? Uh, I'm gonna agree. What the hell? You're conscious. Huh. Dude, I don't know what I'm doing. According to the book, when your parents grow old, if your 80-year-old grandmother still scrubs the kitchen floor each day, should you try and get her to stop? Not if she's doing a good job. <laughs> oh, Joe's answers. Yes. Ah, oh, so, okay. I got you. So they made a little joke and then they give you. Okay. You have been invited to someone's home for dinner at 8. According to Miss Manners, you should never arrive after what time? Dessert? What's my answer? Oh, agree. 8, 12, so 12 minutes? What is this, college? Actually, 12 minutes makes place much sense. Like, you don't want to show up a half an hour late, you know? True or false? Happily married women have stronger immune system than those with sour marriages. They also have newer cars, more clothes, and poo in living hell. True, okay. Let me answer one more question, then I can stop this. Let's go, Pam. According to the book Do's and Taboos Around the World, which contains tips to tourists aboard, what does it mean when an Arab grabs your hand? Friend, right? You gotta watch yourself to you. <laughs> Pam's answer, he wants to talk to you in private. Agree. Dang it. It's an honor, a sign of friendship. Yeah, all right. This is a sign of goodbye. 